We're picking up right where we left off in the last episode. We're just going to venture over here real quick, and we're going to actually go back to base and start working on some things there. But I had to come check this out, kind of see what's on this side, just to kind of take a peek at it. I know we can't do much in the red. After this, we're going to go back and kind of regroup and figure out what we need to do to actually make this shroud passable. So we actually can go through it the legit way, but at least we're over here. We can explore if we want to. We can kind of look around and hopefully find some good like loot spots that we can go ahead and start grabbing stuff. That'd be awesome. We can also take these guys out and start getting there. I really want to do that. Uh, no, no, no. Get rid of that. Put that up. I had those just for a little bit earlier. Where's my wand? There you go. Level 30. Wow, we're in level 30 land now. This is going to take an hour to kill this guy. Okay. I have chain lightning. Let's do it. It does not do very much. <laughs> All right. I don't know what kind of hit he does, so I'm just trying to... I don't know what he does, so I'm kind of waiting to see. I feel like he would hit really hard. Oh, we don't even have our buffs going. We just kind of came over here on a whim. I was actually going to turn back and go back and do some base stuff. It's about to be nighttime. So I'm going to get these scales off of these guys. And then we're going to see how close we are to making our armor. And we're going to see how close we are to making the next upgrade for the altar. So we can actually pass through the next round. There you go. This guy is resist the junk out of this stuff. There we go. A little bit of acid burn. Nice. And also, if we hit him in a better spot, it does look better. There you go. So these guys give decent scales, usually. Oh my god, we're completely full. Um, hmm. Okay, hopefully I read this correctly. Looks like we have to go for the Umber Hollow and go down here and fight the Red Mushrooms. So the Umber Hollow, I think, is that area there. I think. So we got to go down there. we got to find the big red scary mushrooms and see if we can defeat them. This is how we get to strengthening our altar and then hopefully getting into the red shroud over there a little bit easier. And pretty much opening up the rest of the map once we do that. So that will be awesome. Hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Like, comment, subscribe as always. I really do appreciate all the support. It's been a really fun playthrough of Enshrouded. We are getting closer to the end of it. So there won't be too many more videos for it. We want to have a complete playthrough that we can upload as like one full playthrough so that's kind of the idea behind all this we're going to start doing that with some of the games we play make sure that we have like a full playthrough for it, it makes a little bit of fun but all right guys i will see you oh what were we doing outro for i will see you in the umber hollow in just a minute okay we had to run back to base to grab a couple things now we're back in it i'm hoping that we can take these guys out i don't know a lot about fighting them other than it says that it's hard we're going to go down here i think the umber hollow is like right there let's uh let's just land here real quick just make it easy on myself there you go. So I can go a little bit further in without really struggling. Go. It's good to see my stamina this high, though. All right. About to drop in. I've also got one of the potions for the Wisp and another one for... What is the other one called? I can't even think what the other one's called off the top of my head. We got one for Wisp and then another one for longer time in the Shroud. There we go. Umbra Hollow. All right. Sweet. All right. There it is. That's who we have to defeat. And they don't seem to take much damage. Oh, that's not too bad. Aim for his glowy bits. It said aim for the glowy bits. All right. Okay, we're getting it done. If we could just stay up here and never get down there, we'd be fine. But this is how we get the ammonia gland. This is one of the many items that we need uh, to include this little the mint meat down here. Okay, wait for all that stuff to go away. Hold on. Good. All right. So we got four ammonia glands. So theoretically, I need to kill at least five of these. Oh, wait, there's another one. Okay, so I got a couple out of that. Hold on. We got... Backpack. We got six. That would be pretty sweet if we could kill a few less of them. And then we need a bunch of this. I need 20 of this as well. So it's time to start gathering all of these ingredients. We need 20 of the green stuff, 20 of the ammonia things, 
And then there's a whole lot of other things that are going to be a little harder to get, but we'll work on that as we go a little further in. Give me that. Give me that. Let me keep an eye on how much we have. We just need 20. Don't need to overdo it for these ones. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, yeah, we'll be good to go on this one. There we go. 13, 14. That was it. Can I not hit you? Come on. Kind of keep an eye out for another one of those guys. It'd be nice if we could cheese them all like that, but I know we're going to have to get into a couple closer fights, and they're just brutal. All right. I lost count. We have 16. I don't think this is the right one. Is that? No, it is. Okay. 17. Okay. That one's not giving us any love. Over here. There we go. We get a few more out of that. One, two. And last one. Got it. Okay, one, two, three. So that should be 20. All right. Back to the ammonia gland. Yep, I see you. We're not messing with you. And I don't know my way down here, so we can get lost really easy. And that could be really bad down here. We've got five minutes. Let's go ahead and do... Oh, God. Yep, I heard you. Oh, ho, ho. Really? Okay. All right, we can block this guy good. There you go. Keep hitting him. There you go. We'll just trade blows with you. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. As we were saying here, I've got Shroud Survival. Should add two minutes. It did not. Yeah, oh, you need to do it before you come in. Got it. And then this should add some kind of light. It's not much. <laughs> Poor birds down here. Okay, which way are we going? We are on the wrong side of this little area. Okay, so next time do the little trout thing before you come down here. Four minutes. Let me see if I can find the little town that's down here because we can use that to our advantage. It's that lava area. Yep, that one there. Here we go. Jasper Isles. Yep, this is what we're looking for. I know it's kind of hard to see down here. Hopefully, you guys can see okay. Some free treasure. Nice. Alright, do we have to go down? What do we got? Okay. Oh, my bad. Stay away from that. Okay, nothing really important down here. This one. <laughs> find that one again. We didn't need it again, but that's fine. Oh, we got a cool ring. All right. We are down to two minutes. It's getting a little dicey now. Oh, we found it. We got up right above it. There's also some things below us we'll take care of in a minute. Okay. I know there's a big guy over here. We're just going to try and kill this real quick. Just trying to reset our time down here. There's the big guy. Let's just ignore him. I don't think he's coming this way yet. Let's just chill. That reset my time down here, so we can actually search around a little bit, but I don't think we're going to. Okay, he's already coming after us. Oh, we couldn't get up there. Okay, yep, he can. Come on, go, 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 go. Take that. <laughs> all right, he fell all the way back down. Perfect. There's two of them. All right, we can take this one out. All 
All right, there's one. If they give me a few per, we're going to be good. Okay, Carol, oh God, that's not how we want to get down there, but okay. Oh God. <laughs> okay, shooting in the head works. Okay, search that. Give me all the ammonia. Yeah, I got six from that one. Okay. Maybe seven. Maybe there was just six. Wait for the dust to settle. I got six out of that one, too. So that actually put me at 19. I need one more. All right. One more red mushroom. Where are you at? Now that we know we can defeat these guys. What is this? Buka Cave Passage. Oh, we found a gold chest just in the middle of everything. Just kind of hiding out here. Nothing down here other than dead end. I think I can get over there, though. Go. Nailed it. Alright, cool. Looks like this takes me up and out. Uh, we can go reset if we want to. I don't know which way to go to find more. I think we have to go all the way back to the Umbra Hollow area. We got a little away from there. We're over near, like, Lupa's or something. Yeah. There it is. Okay, come on, dude. Go, go, go. Okay, I don't... I'm afraid this guy's gonna, like, one-shot me. I don't know. We're gonna about to find out. No, we're okay. There we go. Let him sneeze. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Okay, they're not that bad. We were kind of afraid of these guys. It wasn't as bad as I had worried. There you go, man. That was it. We got it. That was three of them. That, or four of them. I don't even know now. Let that clear out. Then we'll sneak in, grab those, and then we're at an exit area. Perfect. Come on. There we go. There you go. And there were six of them inside there. Perfect. Ooh, man. That is exactly what we needed. Ow. Run through here. There was something cool looking up here, so I wanted to hit it up. Okay. I think it's just a... Like a vantage point so you can see which way to go. But I can head all the way back home. We can kind of see what we need to get next. I know we don't have everything, but we should be close. All right. So we are short. Oh, my God. All that we're short is 10 ore, and I have everything else. Okay. I don't remember where a good place for 10 is. I know it's going to be over there on the right side of the map where we were at. So let's... Oh, you know what? I do. Back in the village that we were in in the last one. Well, I know I know it sucks that I have to scroll like this, but it's the only way to do it. There's a a cave right here. So okay, I just need like a handful of tin ore. We can strengthen the flame, and then the red shroud is no longer a problem. Or at least as far as I know. We might still have like a little bit of issues, but yeah, there's the stuff we need is like right over here. Oh, we're about to get it. There we go. Awesome. Good good glide. Should be right here. There we go. Right here. There you go. Kick his butt. Yep. Don't let him shoot. Don't let him shoot. There we go. Awesome. And then here it is. We just come in here and grab as much as we need. All right. Tin ore, man. Let me mine for a minute, and then I'll see you guys back at base. We already have enough right now. There we go. Time to wake up, and time to strengthen the flame. Let's do it. Gain global benefits. Flame level 4 to 5. It is expensive. There's a lot of supplies. There you go. Boom. It also allows us to make another one. Flame level 5. That's awesome. That was huge. 
Gave us a nice bit of XP. Looks like we got a few points to spend. And now, all that red that we were afraid of earlier, now I should be able to go through it without any issues. Hold on, where are we at? Back down to the spire over here. So now, theoretically, if we go back to that spire down there, we can look around, we can go down into things, and we can actually have a little bit of fun. There shouldn't be anywhere locked off. Now I can go back and backtrack and get all the missions done that we were having trouble with. There's a few that we were kind of like landlocked on. Oh, yeah, look at Look at that. It's all beautiful blue. No more scary red. Oh, wait. No, there's scary red down there. Okay, you know what I didn't do? I didn't check. Is there another upgrade after that? I, I didn't look closely enough. I should have checked that out. We can look real quick. Is there another? Oh, man. I didn't think this through. Okay. There is a, there's another level. We need sulfur. Easy. Spark, easy. Iron ore, not too bad. Lapis, a little hard. Yucca, I don't know if we started getting that yet. Bell, so I haven't seen that guy yet. And saffron might be a, something I have to work on a little bit too, but there you go. I had to come back over here to check. Okay, so we still got one more upgrade. So we're not completely OP now. We've got some things to do. But we can start getting through these missions now and work really hard on those. Let me see. We got Sun Temple Stories. We've got stuff for the laboratory. They must be brought back. So that one, what is that one? That one is just craft a laboratory, okay. So we have that. Hold on, back to the thing. Heart of Iron, that's a spot for the blacksmith. It's to the south of here. No, there's definitely red down there still. Dang it, man. All that area up there is good, but now down here is still a little bit scary. So I don't know if, like, this area I can still get into. But, like, I can go here. I don't know. Let me kind of see. Oh, it's definitely into the red. So there's, it's a no-go still. Wow, we have so much to explore still. That's awesome. I'm actually excited about that. That's a very good thing. But it is down there somewhere. Or actually, it's further ahead even. Oh, so cool. This game, dude, this game is incredible. The way they lock, lock stuff in and the way you keep progressing. The progression in this game is amazing. The fighting is great. The monsters are cool. The world is amazing. I, This game is top tier. Oh, I don't even have ammo. <laughs> Let's not go make him mad just yet then. So we could theoretically pass down this way, right? Oh, this is all just wide open now. Probably shouldn't be here without any arrows, but we can get sulfur easily now. Let's just cruise by here. We're just going to ignore you. And you know while we're down here, let's keep working on scales. As long as he doesn't come down here, we'll work on getting a few more scales from these guys. Doesn't seem like it does a lot of damage. Oh! Oh, he one-shot me. I didn't mean he didn't do damage. I was talking about me. Man. Okay, so let's get a quick idea of what we need for our next tier of armor, the top tier that we can make so far. I can make a bunch of padding now, which is great. Well, not a bunch. I can make six six of that. We need padding to make the Deerstalker stuff. We could do... Dad, I don't like the look of that one. It's any of the three of these. Either one, we need scales. So this one, I need five, 25, 35, 45, 50... 54 we have that okay so that's doable and then padding we need 2 6 7 8 12 13 so doable this one just and these two just change they just need yellow fabric in place of the top one that needs just a little bit of everything but this is expensive this one actually needs see scales 20 30 40 55 65. Need 65 and I'll have 58. So actually, we're not far off. We could maybe do that. Padding is going to be the limiting factor because I need 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 12 total. And I think I can only make... Hold on. What did we say? Because I'm short on leather, we can only make 6 so far. And then I've got a decent amount of fabric already coming up inside of here. We've got 31 inside of there. And we should have more... Not there. Should have more linen coming up in a second, too. We can do just a little bit of farming to make sure that's good to go. And then here soon we'll be moving to the new base where we have a lot more area for farming. 
And let me harvest all this so we can keep this going. All right, we have done nonstop grinding for the last like hour or two, just trying to get all the materials that we need. I hope we're close. We should be really, really close to this. The one holdup, I think, is gonna be padding. I don't know if we have enough for that. I think we're gonna fall a little bit short because we need a total of two, four, five, six, seven, 12, 13, 14, and we just don't have that. I don't know if I have any other leather hidden anywhere that I could find, but that's the one thing that we're just short on. I just cannot seem to find enough of it. But we've been, we're gonna keep grinding it out a little bit more, but I just, I'm not sure what to do. Uh, <gasps> wait, leather. Oh, we can make leather. I forgot about this one. Gosh dang it. Okay. Change of plans. So I'll be honest. This is one of the first times where we really had to kind of stop and grind a little bit. I mean, we grind quite a bit in this game just kind of for fun, running around, gathering things. But this is the first time we actually stopped and just focused completely on that. Let me see if we're going to be somewhat close. We're up to 18, so I can make nine sets of 10. 15 minutes per, though, so it is going to take a little while. Just We need 10 of the dried fur. Hopefully, we're getting close on that. We got 24. Boom. There you go. That will get this going. We'll make our first leather on our own. We were going out and gathering it on, on our own. I kind of didn't realize I could have been making it here the whole time. So there is some dried fur. I think I have... Oh, that's cool looking. And I think I have some over here, too. thought I had some more dried fur hanging out somewhere. Let me see. Oh, we got tons. Oh, we're rolling. Okay, cool. Dried fur for days. So we have at least a few of those coming up. That's going to take 15 minutes per. And we can make the padding that we needed now. I want to make the large backpack. But I want the... I really want to focus first on... Because that takes leather and linen. Man. All right. We're going to do the large backpack after. That's going to be huge. 24 slots. How cool is that? But I want to go ahead and make the padding so we can make the deerstalker set. So let's go ahead and make a little bit that we can. I can make nine to start with. There we go. We can go deerstalker set. I can't make that one because I need one leather. Oh, dang it. I need one leather for that, but I might be able to make the rest. So here we go. Helmet, check. Gloves, check. Pants, and, and then I need more. Oh, we need six leather for that one, and I need... Oh, we're going to be pretty close, though. Look at that. So we're gearing up slowly. Let me wait around on this for a little while. This is going to be uh, just a little bit of a wait. I'm going to keep gathering and grinding for stuff. We're also making... We were making dried fur over here still. Yeah, we're still doing dried fur here. That'll take a little while to get that going. I also need to switch and do fossilized bone dust. Which, do I have that on me or did I drop it off? I might have dropped it off already. Let me grab that. No, one of these over here. Just going to take a second to find it. Like that. Is that it there? Fossilized. There's fossilized bone. There it is. So we take this and we make fossilized bone dust. Right? Go like, where is it? Like that. Like that. There you go. All right. That one's crafting up too. And then there's a couple other things that we need to kind of work on and do. We can go do some missions while we're waiting on that. So let me do some inventory stuff. And then we'll either make the armor first or we'll head out. I'm not sure what the direction we're going to go first is. But we got a little bit more time left in today's episode. So let's get it going. All right. The first bit of leather is finally up. There we go. Man, I am excited that we're finally getting into this one. We can get our armor going. We're going to be all geared up. We'll make a whole bunch of arrows. And then we're going to be golden. So deerstalker set. So we need the chest piece. Got it. And now I need the boots. And the last thing we need, I need five padding to make the pants. So can we make five padding? Let's see. Padding, I need more linen. I think we have more linen. We have somewhere. We have more linen. There you go. And now can we make it? All right. Make padding. I think I said four. We need more fabric. All right. Come on. What are we short on? Let me just double check. Let's go ahead and actually pin the one that we need, which is the pants. Pin that. I just need three more padding. We need a little bit of this here. Split. Throw that there. This makes up pretty quick, so it won't be... Oh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> it makes up in two minutes. So that'll take just a little bit to get that done. But we at least have part of the armor ready. We've got all but the pants. And then we are good, man. Awesome. We are so close. And then the last thing we'll need is once there's another set of leather done, 
we can make the backpack. And then we have a large backpack. So this is like is super upgrade day. Lots of cool things going on. So now I got to wait on that. Let me get some more flax going. So we'll have more of that going. And yeah, just the endless cycle now. Okay, I think we have everything we need for the final bit. Let's go ahead and get it. I need... Oh, wait, need the stuff for the padding. Let's grab that here. And that there. Now we should be able to make the last... What is it? Two pieces of padding? We need two more padding. No. So let's go padding. One, two... And then now, the deer stalker pants. Boom. All right. We have the actual full set now. So let's go like that. Got the deer one. Oh, wait. Gotta go like that. Equip. Go like that. Equip. Like that. Equip. I know we could have done this from the menu, too, but I want to be able to see it as we put it on. All right. So now... That gives us 31, 75, 20, plus there's a lot of other multipliers on here. Plus 4 stamina regen, minus 350 stamina regen de delay, plus 18 stamina, plus 1 sprint speed. That's awesome. Plus 6% range damage, 12% damage multiplier. This one gives plus 24 health, plus 48 stamina. And this gives critical strike damage and range critical strike damage. Nice. There you go, man. Looking pretty good, too. All right. That was the big stuff there. The last thing that we need to do, if we can, is make the large backpack. There you go. The and then we go ahead and equip. And then boom. Now we have even more storage space to play with, which is awesome. All right. I want to knock out one more mission. So that was a lot of stuff we got done today. That was awesome. Leather, copper. I made a whole bunch of copper arrows. Backpack, linen... I'm going to go ahead and drop. Keep that. I was going to go ahead and use these. I don't know if they're worth using. Is it a... I don't know if it's an experience boost or how that works. All right, so we were working on that one. We're not too far from getting to that one. So let me go back up there. I keep seeing those blue guys down there. Those guys are going to be a problem. I think they're a little bit tougher than the other one, it seems like. All right, for whatever reason, I haven't been able to use the space bar. Did I accidentally unequip my thing? Hold on. Character. Hold on. I didn't accidentally... Skills. No, we still have all of our skills. I don't know why... Okay. Yeah, I don't know why I couldn't fly, but that's fine. We're almost to the area. We just got a little bit further to go. It's a lot of shrouded area. There we go. Now I can do it. I don't know why I couldn't before. Maybe it was a stamina issue. There we go. I haven't been down in that area, so I don't know if it's, like, super bad or if there's more of those crazy mushrooms. Oh, this new armor, though, is legit. All right. Let's go through here. Perfect. Right up on the hill. Uh oh No, blue guy. Okay. We're about to get a test. We're still going? Okay. Okay, we can take it. It's just going to be a little bit painful. All right. Go like that. Oh, there's good stuff to gather right there. I really want to gather that. There you go. Good job. So it wasn't too bad. It wasn't like absolutely... Oh, that noise though. 100 meters this way. It's a really good gather area. Am I hearing wings or am I hearing... I'm not sure. All right. We're going here. I don't know if we go down or if we go across. Stop it. <laughs> there we go. It looks like it's below, right? Can we go this way? about 100 meters away. Brittle bush. So I think this is the right area. Uh, location reached. Defeat the specter. Okay. Yep. I need to get back to the other arrows. Come 
Come on. Oh, that didn't kill it. There we go. Yep, I see our little friend over there. Okay, so is this... This location reached? Is he inside of here or just in this village somewhere? Of course, it's about to be nighttime, so we're going to have to deal with that. Oh my god, we were right next to this the whole time. Look at that. It was literally right above us. There's our thing. Oh, there's bad things happening back there. Oh, wow. There's a lot of dead. Okay. Alright, I need to put the heels on the correct hot bar. Ow. So many dead people in the beginning over here. Lots of spores. Alright. Yeah, just dead things everywhere. Oh, that guy. Okay, that's what was causing that. Yep. I hear him coming. Yep. Let's go. Let's go. Bring you back out to the light so we can see. Pretty good. Good job. Go team. Let me get the flame up here. Thank you. That should heal me up. I feel like that should definitely heal me up. Alright. Take some more stuff. We're going down for a battle. That's not the guy, is it? Level 24. Very nice. Okay. Oh, we got two levers. Okay. Okay. The other way is down. Got it. And it's literally right there. Okay. That should be both the switches. There you go. Door is open. We are probably going to die. Oh, the, you see how the light's going everywhere? Okay, that's awesome. Oh, ow. Okay, that can go like through things. No, 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 no. Okay, we had to cut yesterday's recording session just a little bit early. Uh, we had to go ahead and end it where we were. We died in there several times. We're going to go back in one more time. Well, not one more time. We're going to go back in a couple more times, see if we can get this done. Well, that's a good way to start. We're going to see if we can get up there, get this done, and try to beat this boss one more time. I did go ahead and do a couple different points into a couple other areas. One of our friends kind of talked to us a little bit about how to kind of respec our character a little bit. So we added a bunch of points into basically the battle mage side of things. So we can do a little bit of blocking with the wand, and then hopefully 
just do a little bit of damage this way. I think we should see quite a bit more damage now that we've kind of respect into that. Uh, you know, the bad thing I didn't really think about is all the bad guys are going to be on our way in there again because it's been like a full 24 hours in real life since we were in here. And I know we shouldn't be grabbing all the loot. We just need to go where we need to go, but it's all right. There you go. Let's see if it's more damage now. Oh, it's way more damage. Oh, my God. Oh, it's way better. Okay, good call. Our friend Otto hooked us up with that, so that was awesome. This will be a, a really good. Oh, you know what I didn't think about? We're going to have to do the little puzzle again, which it's not hard. This is an easier one, but still, we'll have to do the thing again. Let's go through it kind of quickly. Do we have to do the thing? Like, I just, I'll just assume that we have to, so we'll just run back here. We'll do this one super quick. What's up, man? Don't mind me. Click the button. And then we'll fly down. There we go. And then we'll go down. Same thing. Nail that. Got it. Alright. Now, before we go in here, make sure we're not getting attacked. Like that. Oh, my bad. I didn't mean to eat something. My bad, my bad. Hold on. Come on. I hate those guys. All right, so let's heal up. Let's go ahead and get all of our food up. I actually brought a couple really cool foods for this. And I just realized that since I ate that berry, we can't do one of these. I can't do the fruit. But we can do dexterity. Use. We can do this one, which is plus 5 endurance. And then we can do this one, which is plus 30% damage. And then we got the berry going, which does its thing. So if we get if it gets a little dicey, uh, we don't have the extra health, which is kind of a bummer. But if it gets too dicey, we switch over to the wand and we just block and do the wand as much as possible. There you go. I just can't dodge those things. How am I supposed to dodge them? Oh, no. No. No, I just got my buffs going. Okay, where's our big specter friend here? Here we go. Oh, I can't block his thing. Okay. Wasn't sure if I could block that, but we can. Oh, okay. We can't dodge through it. Got it. <laughs> I beat it. Uh, <laughs> oh, I cannot tell you how many times we died on that one. Oh, that was painful. Oh, my God. That was painful. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to include all the times we did die. It was somewhere around a bajillion. You can see all my death markers down here. <laughs> we died here. We died there. We died everywhere. That was a lot, of, a lot of fun. That was a cool fight, man. That was actually a really cool fight. What do we got here? Oh, Banebringer. I wish it was a little bit better level. That is cool looking, though. Uh, yep. I'll deal with you guys in just a second. Just need to make sure I'm not missing any loot down here. There we go. Just you, hopefully. Alright. Oh, yep. More friends. Please don't die to these guys now. Alright. One more. Oh. Must have came from that other side. Gotcha. Okay. Just do a quick search for little side areas. Oh, yep, yep. <laughs> this, of course. Uh, I have one last heal, so let's use that. There we go. 
shot a couple extras. That's fine. They're going to keep popping out, probably. Just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Nothing there. Nothing back there. All right. I think we're good to go. All right. Awesome, man. That was a extremely awesome fight. Definitely a lot of fun. Let me make sure I got all of my death markers. Oh, that was I thought I was gonna fall off. Alright, should be one more somewhere. There we go, we survived it. So that's gonna do it for today's episode. That was absolutely brutal. That was basically two days of recording with us really struggle busting it through it. I know that we've kind of advanced kind of past where we're able to in terms of some of the things that we prepared for. But it's kind of the way we do it. We kind of jump face first into things. But hopefully, it's still been enjoyable. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed the episodes. I really do appreciate it. I've been getting caught up in a little bit of the comments. So if you guys see a reply from me from the last couple of months, it's because I'm just now, for the first time in a long time, able to sit down and reply to comments. So I'll try to get back to a bunch of those. Thank you so much. If you made it to the end of the video, my MVP, I, these videos get a little bit long sometimes. Sometimes they're 20 minutes, sometimes they're 50 minutes, and I lose control. Anyways, I'm rambling at the end. I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.